Welcome back everybody. This is Eric here with Iraq Veteran 8888. Today we got a really special video for you. I got my friend Ernest here from FX Air Guns and we're going to be shooting soldiers off of tanks on tanks from tanks. Right? Yes. <laughs> He's got a really special gun here that we're going to be checking out. This is a Dreamline Compact, also known as the, the Dream Tac. So it's basically the tactical version of the Dreamline. And you're definitely, you're, you're the Q of the group. You're the guy that uh, it plays around with all the fancy stuff and swaps things and messes around with different components mm -hmm. on these guns. So wh where does this particular air gun fit in FX's line in terms of what its role is? Uh, I love these for short range sniping. This is the gun. It's light. You can man easily maneuver it and kill. I think we're going to do that. Yes. I'm going to spot for you. You're yeah. going to jump up on this tank and we've got some enemy soldiers here on the opposite tank mm -hmm. and we need to take cover because they're little tiny little guns are going to be shooting at us. We have to avoid those. The thing about today's video we have to remember is that it's okay to be a kid and we're a couple of grown men shooting army men just like we're six years old again. Buddy, enough talking. Let's, let's get on a kill mode, and it's a great day to die. <laughs> All right, let's do it. Today we're gonna be having a lot of fun. Now, the tank over here that we are shooting these soldiers off of, a quick little bit of trivia. Um, this is the tank that Rick crawled under in the first season of The Walking Dead. Uh, so this is actually, both of these tanks we're sitting on are Walking Dead movie props. Uh, and also one of these tanks was used as a prop in one of the Zombie Land films as well. I think the Zombie Land 2 film. Anyway, without further ado, we're going to have some fun. Now, Ernest, we got to take these soldiers out in the right order, okay? We don't want them to call for help. So we want to take out the radio operator first. Okay. Kill mode. He is, now that wind <laughs> is picking up. We're about 28 yards away. Not very far, but these guys are kind of tiny. They're going to be tough to hit. Um, the radio operator, Ernest, is on the rear of the hatch. See him? Impact. All right, we're going to take out the officer. He's right down below. You see him? Copy. Give it a second here. Now, he's pointing a pistol. You see him? He's got a pair of binoculars. Do you think you can shoot the pistol out of his hand? Confirm. All right. Send it. Oh, gosh. I think you nicked it. You got it. You shot, going. you shot the piss. You shot his hand off. <sighs> All right, finish him off, man. Oh, oh, no. Look, his little legs are left. I'm loving it. Oh, okay. So we, Next got, story. we got another officer over there. We got to take out the officers first. All right. Oh, that mortarman looks scary. We got, okay, okay. There, okay. So on the front of the turret, on the uh, on the lifting bracket, we got another officer. Shoot the binoculars out of his hand this time. Oh, he, Whoa, sh he shot the pistol out of his hand again. All right, take him out. There. Oh. <laughs> Next target. Okay, let's see. We're gonna move on. All right, we've got. All right, out on the barrel of the tank, we've got a couple of soldiers out there. We definitely. All right, now, I hate to take out a fellow mortarman, guys. But you know what? It's warfare. We do things we have to do, okay? We got the mortarman there. See if he can shoot the mortar out of his hand, Ernest. See the mortarman? Oh! <laughs> all right, we're going all the way back up to the top of the turret. There's a green barrel sitting there. You see it? Confirm. All right, hang on here. Uh, we got a guy with an M16 sitting there. Uh, I wonder if it's like the movies and the little barrel will blow up, but... Take him out. See if you can shoot the rifle out of his hand. Oh. <laughs> Too easy. What's All right, next? finish him off. Ooh. All right, take out the barrel too. That's an easy shot. There you go. Okay. All right, we're going to go all the way back up. We got a minesweeper and, oh, there's a guy throwing a grenade. Good thing we're not in grenade range. So you see him up there on top? Yep. The minesweeper. Mm. Take him out. Arm? Uh, shoot the minesweeper out of his hand. <laughs> that guy's gone. His arms are gone. Finish him? Yeah, take him out. Good shot. All right, to his right, there's the minesweeper up there. Mm -hmm. See him up on yeah. top? Headshot. Headshot? Oh, good shot, man. Yeah, fantastic. Finish. 
<laughs> There's nothing left of him. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna move down a little bit here. Who's left? All right, oh. down on the rear of the tank, all the way on the rear of the turret. We got a couple of bogeys down there. How about the bazooka uh, fella first? All right. Good center mass shot on the bazooka. <laughs> uh, thank you. Shot a little bit high. Oh yeah, you got him. All right, we got one more machine gunner on the rear there. Uh, you see the mag sticking up on his Bren gun? Yeah. Shoot the mag off his Bren gun. Oh. You got him. Oh. Good shot. All right, we're going to reconfirm, make sure that we don't have any bogeys left. I see one. Yep. <laughs> got him. That was the last man. There's nothing wrong Ooh. with feeling like a kid again. You know what I mean? <laughs> Even though I'm 71, I feel young. 71. You are not 71. I'll break out my ID here in a minute. I don't believe him for one second he's 71 <laughs> years old. Well, I will say this. I appreciate your service in the Navy. Ernest spent 20 years in the Navy, retired, yeah. and you've seen some interesting stuff. So w did you ever think that as you got older that you would be shooting Army men from a tank off another tank? No. 20 years in the military, mostly I'm down in the pit. Now I'm on a tank. Shoot Moving up, up in the world. <laughs> <laughs> Ernest, thanks for hanging out oh, with me today. It was a pleasure telling you. Absolutely. I feel like this young man, again. <laughs> this man here, he's the Q of the group. This is so cool to have him here. He's a legend in the air gun world, and uh, I really appreciate you hanging out with me I today. I enjoyed it. I feel Absolutely. so young just shooting him up. <laughs> oh, it was fun. You blew him out of their boots. There's a, literally a pair of boots sitting there. I still. wanted to shoot him, but you want me to go to the next guy. But. <laughs> I think we took him out in the right order, though. Oh, that's it. Well, uh, you're welcome down anytime you want to visit. We Love really it. appreciate it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely. So, guys, thank yeah. you so much for watching today's video. We hope you enjoyed it. Many more on the way. We've got tons of cool things going on, uh, including, you know, we've had FX down doing some great videos. Um, this is the 177 repeater, which is definitely more of your backpacking, plinking, mm -hmm. truck gun, um, you know, shooting army men, that yeah. type of stuff. Uh, but we have some other uh, larger bore things on the mm -hmm. way. So I don't know what, uh, what order these videos will come out, but uh, stay tuned. Lots of great videos on the way. Thanks, Ernest. Oh, pleasure.